What's up, Peak Timers? Phil here from Peak Time Racing. Today, we're unboxing the 2023 Hot Wheels A case. I get all of my cases from Granatoys. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels case sent to you each time a new one comes out, check out granatoys.com. Links in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case is Ragin' Express, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the classic TV series Batmobile Tuned. Hopefully, we find one of these in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start it right at the top right here. We'll pull out our first cars for the 2023 case. And the first ones that we have are the HW Rapid Response. We got Bricken Speed and we've got the Nissan Patrol Custom. This looks to be a brand new casting. Very, very cool. That's interesting. We even got like a wide body look on it. The exposed engine on the front as well. That's gonna be an interesting one to open up and looks like we've got a card that's maybe slightly ripped here as well. So that's kind of a mistake, but that's all right, no big deal. All right, we'll open the top right here. We'll go right here. We've got Track Manga. We've got the classic TV series Batmobile and this one looks to be just the regular mainline variation, not the Super Treasure Hunt. Then we also have the Renin Rig. We'll go up right here now. We've got uh, the 69 Copo Camaro in yellow, the Dodge Challenger Drift car, and a Lamborghini Mira SV. I like those three. Great, great three cars right there. We've got the 70s van. <laughs> Check out the writing and stuff on there. Wow. Okay, that's definitely interesting livery for, for that one there. We've got the Ragin' Express, and this one, I believe, is the treasure hunt for the case. I believe it is. I have to find the treasure hunt. Oh, yeah, we have the treasure hunt logo right there. It's right in the middle right there, right where my thumb is. You can see that treasure hunt logo. So there we go. We got the treasure hunt for the case. Very awesome. We've got the McLaren Elva. All right, love the McLaren Elva. Nice new color of that one. And we've got the 65 Mustang 2 plus 2 Fastback. And we have a Lotus Emira in the blue. So a couple of carryover cars from last year's case, the 2022 Q case. Then we have a look at this one, Dragon Wagon. Wow. Okay, that is definitely a unique looking casting from Xperia Motors. All right, that'll be cool to open up and see what that looks like as well. We've got the Ford Escort RS200, and I believe that one is also a new casting as well. Wow, okay, that's kind of interesting. Not really my style of car, I have to say. Not really my thing, but that's okay. We've got the Honda Super Cab, and then we have the 81 Camaro, and this one is the mainline variation. So you guys saw in my 2022 Q case, I got two Super Treasure Hunts of this one. I didn't get the mainline, so now we've got the mainline variation of it, so awesome. So we'll have to pair that with our Supers. We'll put that aside right there, and then we've got Another 69 Copo Camaro, uh, the 72 Ford Gran Torino, and the 1970 Pontiac Firebird. Ooh, that Firebird is looking good. I really like that one, very nice. All right, we'll put those ones aside. We've got uh, Brickin' Trails again. Uh, oh no, maybe not again. Maybe we had a different one and we had a different bricking one before, but these are the ones that have that Mega Blocks uh, slash Lego on there so you can Coordinate those with your Lego stuff. Uh, 40s Ford pickup in red and the Porsche 911 GT3. And I believe we saw both of these ones in the previous game. Uh, maybe not the Ford. Yeah, maybe we did. I can't remember exactly, but we'll put those aside. We've got the 84 Audi Sport Quattro in that new blue color. We've got the Batmobile and the Sweet Driver. Check out the Sweet Driver. Looks like a new color variation of that one. We've got the Honda Civic Custom, the, ooh, check that out, the LB Super Silhouette uh, Nissan Silvia S15 in black with gold trim. That is fresh looking. I like that one. Even look at the Liberty Walk riding on the side, blacked out wheels with the gold chrome. Very nice car. Uh, another one of the 81 Camaros. That is just the standard one, not a Super Treasure Hunt, so very nice. And, oh wow, look at the new color of the Pagani Wyra Roadster. Wow, very nice white color with the gold wheels on there. It's like a pearl white color. 
looking so good. All right, we got the Dodge Challenger Drift car and the 20, uh, 2006 Pontiac GTO, 2006 Pontiac GTO, there we go. All right, and we are down to the bottom of our first half right here. Ford Shelby GT 350R. Uh, I think we saw that one in the previous case as well. We got the Mock It Go in a HW Speed Team kind of like see-through colorway. And we've got the Aston Martin V12 Speedster in that satin matte black. I like that. All right, we'll put these cars aside. We'll go down to the bottom half of our case right here. Take that out and we'll see what we have starting at the top right here. Uh, we've got the Batmobile right there. There's that one with that exposed engine. Uh, Desert Drifter, or Desert Drifter. Yeah, I, I was like, did I? is it Desert Drifter? No, it's Desert Drifter, and it's got like some sort of dessert thing on there. Okay, that's interesting. Another one of the Ford Escort RS 2000s right there. Awesome, awesome. And we'll go up to the top. Again, we've got the 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. That's a new red color. And we've got the McLaren Elva again and a red sand burner. I'm, like I was saying, we're seeing a lot of red cars recently. I'm not too sure why. I guess red cars just, it's kind of like the new end thing, I guess. I don't know, but I like them. They're good. Uh, Lotus Amira. Uh, we've got the Eruption and the classic TV series Batmobile. Is it the Super? Nope. It is just another mainline variation of it, but still, Pretty cool, pretty cool. Maybe we'll get the Supra. There might still be a chance of getting the Supra of it in here. Uh, we've got the Porsche 911 GT3 in the satin black style finish right there. Uh, 65 Mustang 2 plus 2 Fastback. And we've got the 84 Audi Sport Quattro in that blue color. I love that blue color. We saw them in the previous case, but still happy to have it in this case right here. Uh, we have got the Coupe Clip. Uh, the Ford Shelby GT 350R and Da, da Vinci, da Vinci Veloce. Check out the color of the Da Vinci Veloce right here. Check out that color. Is that like crazy? The graphics and the wheels and all that. That is really neat. I like that. All right, put that aside and we'll grab. We've got the Lamborghini Mira right there. The HW Kit Concept and that one looks to be a new color variation check out the color on that one hw kit concept it's kind of like black with like a silver bottom on there that's interesting uh we've got the 70 ford cosworth rs 1600 as well cool 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 i like those and we'll grab some more up top right here we've got the honda civic custom right there in that red color uh there is the batmobile and we've got a mock it go so three decent cars all right we'll put those ones aside getting down to our bottom here we've got the cruise bruiser in a brand new color we've got the desert drifter again desert drifter and the nissan patrol custom another one of those ones as well i like it i like it all right We've got Roadster Bites, and we've got the 40 Ford pickup truck, and then we've got the Fast Bed Hauler right there. That looks to be a new color variation of the Fast Bed Hauler. All right, and oh, we've got this one. Oh, this is the one you guys were, I was asking you uh, in my previous case, I had found this one. And I was like, tell me some more about this car. And I guess it was like a show winner style car. Um, it's done very well, but I think it looks really, really cool. I'm yet to open one up. We'll have to open one up for our next video. We've got the Grand Sport Roadster Corvette right there. And we've got the Subaru WX STI. It looks like a new color variation of that one. And our last row, our bottom row right here we've got the um, Aston Martin uh, V12 Speedster uh, we've got another one of the Dragon Wagons right there and we've got the Surfing School Bus all right that looks pretty cool Surfing School Bus and our last three cars right here I do see another is it a super is it a super no, it is not. Doesn't look like it's a Super. Uh, we've got the TV series Batmobile again. Looks like it's not the Super. Uh, we've got the head gasket and we've got the 2006 Pontiac GTO. Guys, comment section down below. What's your favorite car from this case? 2023 Hot Wheels B case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels cases sent to you monthly, check out granatoys.com. Link is in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case 
case is the Surf Crate, and the super treasure hunt for this case is the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL. Although I have heard that people are finding different treasure and super treasure hunts in their 2023 Hot Wheels B case. Let's see what we find. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And right off the bat right there, we can see a little bent card right here. So we'll pull that out. Looks like something got squished in shipping. And this is a Nissan Patrol Custom. Completely bashed up. That's definitely interesting. Not good to see. We'll put that aside and we'll start right up again on the top right here. And we'll see what we have. So we've got the uh, fast bed hauler, the Subaru WRX STI, and the Dodge Van. Dodge Van actually looks like a really cool new color. I like the colorway on that one. That looks good. I'll grab up top right here. We've got Desert Drifter. We've got the Cool Combi, and we've got a Coupe Clip, the Cool Combi in the Moon Eyes edition. That looks really good. And next up top right here, we've got another one of the Dodge Vans. We've got the Corvette Grand Sport Roadster, and we've got the Nissan Maxima Drift Car. And check out the wheels on that. That looks really cool. I like that. Good, good add to the lineup here. We've got the Da Vinci Veloc. We've got the Bentley Continental GT3, and check out the colorway on that. That looks really, really good. I like that one. Very nice. And then we've got the classic TV series Batmobile right here as well. All right, we'll put those aside. We've got the 2023 Nissan Z. Looks to be a new colorway on that. We've got the Dragon Wagon. We'll put those ones down and we'll grab these three up top right here. We've got the Roadster Bite. 2023 Nissan Z again, and we've got the Porsche Panamera Turbo SE Hybrid Sport Turismo in red. It looks to be a new recolor of that one. I like that red, that looks really good. And we've got the Tesla Model Y. Check it out, brand new to the Hot Wheels lineup. Very, very cool. And this one even got that little lip on the front. I can't wait to open that one up. We've got the Nissan Maxima Drift Car, and we've got the Baja Hauler right there. Very, very nice. All right, actually gonna throw that up there so it gets out of the way a little bit. We've got the 1970 Pontiac Firebird, the Rally Speciali, or special, I guess you could say. It looks like it's like the Ferrari 458 Speciali, so it kind of is pronounced like that is how I like to say it, but that looks to be a new casting. We've got Surfing School Bust, all right. And then we've got Standard Cart right here. Uh, Volvo P1800 Gasser. Wow, Hot Wheels Legends Tour winning car right there. Check that out, very good detail. Very cool, love the gassers. The gassers are really cool to the Hot Wheels lineup. We've got the Brick and Trails in blue and it's got the green top right there, very nice. And then we've got the Turbine Sublime right there. Uh, LB Chilouette's Nissan Silvia S15. Very cool, I've seen that casting before, but it's another one to that. And then we've got the Poison Arrow right there. Poison Arrow looks to be a new color of that one. This case is completely mashed up inside for some reason. Look at even the packaging. We've got more bent cards right here. There's another Volvo P1800 Gasser, another one of the Bentleys, and the Custom Small Block. All right, we'll put those aside. We've got our bottom three cars right here. We've got the Hot Wired right there in blue. Looks to be a new color. Uh, we've got the Da Vinci Veloc and Rally Special again, Speciali again. All right, we'll put those aside. We'll take down that and we'll start it off right up the top right here. We've got the classic TV series Batmobile right there. We've got the uh, 2006 Pontiac GTO and the 2017 Pagani Wyra Roadster. I believe we saw those ones all in the previous case, but nice to have in this one right here. We'll actually throw it on this side. And we have custom 2011 Camaro right there. Crazy art cars variation. The Subaru WRX again. And then we've got the Corvette C7 Z06 convertible. Very cool, nice red color on that. I like that one. 
Up top right here, we've got the classic TV series Batmobile. And oh my gosh, this is what I was talking about, guys. This is a super treasure hunt right here. We can see there's the rubber wheel tire combination on there. And this is actually the A-Case Super Treasure Hunt. I've been hearing that people are finding the A-Case Super Treasure Hunts in their case. And here's the main line Batmobile right here. You can see this one's got just regular plastic tires on there and a little bit different paint. And then that's the Super treasure hunt that we have so very odd and like i said i did hear this from other people that were opening up 2023 hot wheels b cases that were finding the a case super treasure hunts in their case sometimes there are variations that come in case to case but i've never heard about a super treasure hunt coming in a different case than what it's supposed to so a little bit late but hey I'll take the AK Super Treasure Hunt. Why not? What a great car. All right, we'll put them aside for now and we will go on to the other ones that I pulled out. I got the 84 Mustang SVO right there in silver. And then we've got the Quick Bite Hot Chicken on there. That's very cool. I like that. And we'll go on up right here. We've got the HW Kit Concept. There's another one of the TV series of Batmobiles. That one is not a supercharger run. That would be, uh, I mean, I check now, even though we found one supercharger run, I'm always curious if we find another supercharger run in the case. Another one, the S15 Nissan Silvias. Very nice. I'll put that aside. We've got the Teed Off in green. We've got the Dragon Wagon and the Desert Drifter right there. And what else do we have up top? We've got Track Manga, another one of the kit concepts and another Corvette C7 Z06 convertible. All right. We've got the 87 C Ford Sierra Cosworth right there. I think we saw that one in our previous case. The 80 El Camino looks to be a new color and a new colorway of the Baja bone shaker right there very cool wheels on that i like that leaving the side looks really nice the paint on that and what else do we have we've got the corvette grand sport roadster again another 84 mustang svo and another tesla model y really like that casting can't wait to open that and we'll go right here we've got air eruption the custom 2011 camaro and skate grom okay and then we'll go We've got a new color of gotta go and it looks to be a new color variation of roger dodger and then another one of those porsche panamera turbo se sport turismos we'll put that aside we've got the bottom row now we've got a 70s van we saw that one in our previous case we've got the ford escort rs 2000 right there and the 1970 pontiac firebird very cool and then our bottom three cars of the case Another one of the Ford Escort RS 200s or 2000s. We've got another Brick and Trails and another 87 Sierra Cosworth right here. All right, guys, comment down below. Let me know what you think about me finding the 2023 Hot Wheels AK Super Treasure Hunt in the 2023 B case. 2023 Hot Wheels C case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels cases sent to you each time a new one comes out, check out granatoys.com. Links in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case is the BMW R9T Racer. And the super treasure hunt for this case is the 68 Copo Camaro. Hopefully we find at least one of those in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And starting off right at the top right here, we'll pull out our first three cars right here. We've got the Rally Special. 2018 Bentley Continental GT3. And check that out. That is crazy. We've got a new Brick and Rides car. It's the Brick and Delivery. That is super interesting and different looking. I did not expect to see one of those, but we've got that now. Let's go ahead up top. Max Steel in a new color, new white color with some red on there. We've got the Volvo P1800 Gasser right there. That's the Hot Wheels Legends Tour winning car. You can see that one just tagged right up top right there. And then we've got Hot Wired and looks to be a new color. And we'll go right up here. We've got Turbine Sublime. 
That is a new color of that one. Good looking wheels on there. We've got the custom small block, part of the Brick and Rides series. And then we've got the Sky Show. It looks like a, another Hot Wheels Jet recolor right there. All right. We've got the standard cart from Mario, the Mario standard cart right here. We've got hot wired again, and then check out the new recolor on the 76 Greenwood Corvette. Wow, that is crazy graphics on the side of there. That's a Hot Wheels art car one, so you know it's gonna have some cool paint job on there. So we'll put those ones aside and we'll go up. We've got the Tesla Model Y. We saw that one in the previous case. We got another one of those. We also saw this one in the previous case, the Roger Dodger. And then we've also got the 1980 El Camino. Perfect. And ooh, that's a cool new recolor of the Diora 3. Check that out. That's a nice looking blue. Some interesting wheels on there. We've got the Nissan Maxima Drift car. And we've got the Baja Hauler. Yeah, some good cars so far in this case. What do we have right here? Oh, look at that. The brand new Remac Navera. Brand new casting. That is super cool. I love that wing. Look at the wing, how it's like super just like up there and raised. That is such a neat new casting. I like that. We've got the 2023 Nissan Z and the Porsche Panamera Turbo SE Sport Turismo. And the paint on the side of this one that looks to be some sort of air right there. You can see how it's like almost like they sprayed it and it's kind of unfinished. So that's an interesting air car that we got kind of messed up paint on that Porsche. All right, what do we have up here? Group C Fantasy. Wow, that is like a new fantasy hypercar. That is cool, I like that. Very, very nice. There's another one of the Nissan Z's and another of the Group C Fantasy cars. All right, and the Dodge Van, we saw that one in our previous case. The Baja Bone Shaker and the 2018 Bentley Continental GT3. Another one of those ones. I think we saw, uh, I think we saw all those ones in the previous case. Oh, wow, look at this. The Pagani Zonda R in white. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. The white recolor with the colored wheels on there. That is amazing. I love this one. Cannot wait to open that one up. We'll have that one up in a soon video where we open that one up. We got another one of the Nissan Drift cars and then we've got already a recolor of the Matt and Debbie Hayes 1988 Pro Street Thunderbird. We saw that one in like a pink color before and now we've got it in the white. That's a quick recolor they've done on that one. Interesting, all right. We've got the 89 Mazda RX-7, the Savannah version. That is a crazy metallic green color. We've got the Dodge van, and we've got the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL. This is the main line, and we, there is a Super Treasure Hunt edition of this one, which I actually do own, so we're gonna pair that together. And what else do we have down here? We've got the uh, cool combi Moon Eyes Edition, Mercedes-Benz Unimog Heavy Rescue Service. There we go, nice one. And this is, I think, the treasure hunt of the case. It is, we can see the little treasure hunt logo right behind there, the BMW R9 T Racer. And let's see, where's our treasure hunt logo on here? Sometimes it's hard to see. I don't really see it on there right now, but once we open it up, we'll be able to see it. Actually, if we look, right on the actual thing right here. You can see, oh, there it is, there it is. So if we match it right there, there's our treasure hunt logo and we can see it just right at the front right there. So we found it, we got it. So we got the treasure hunt for the case. Let's go to the bottom now of this case and see what we have right up top right here. Pull some down. We've got the Dodge Charger Drift car. That's a nice new color of that one. Roller toaster with peanut butter and jelly written on the side of it. That is funny. And then we've got the custom Ford Maverick. Check that out. That's a cool new recolor of that one as well. And we'll go up top right here. We've got the Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect. That is a new one. And that's the Hot Wheels art car. Well, new, uh, we've got the new recolor of it. Look at the tiger on the side of it. Oh, wow, I just noticed that. That is really neat. Check that out. We got another one of the Remac Neveras. Happy to have another one of those. And we've got the Hot Wheels High with the Hot Wheels track written on the side of it. That's an interesting color variation of that one. We'll go up top right here. 
There's another one of the Bricken deliveries. We've got another one of those Porsche Panameras. And this one you can see, see how the paint is proper on this one. It's not like a mist spray. A Dodge Charger Drift in that nice green. We've got another one of those. That's really neat. What else do we have? Uh, we've got the Gotta Go in the yellow. Looks like a Moon Eyes car, but I don't think it is an official Moon Eyes car. Looks like the same color though. We've got the uh, custom 2011 Camaro and we've got Skate Grom, the Tony Hawk edition. We saw those ones in our previous case. We got up top right here. Another one of the Gotta Goes. Looks like a new Bone Shaker color. I mean, we get a ton of Bone Shaker recolors every year, but you know what? I'm not disappointed because they're, they always look cool. I like this one. I like the white walled, like the, the double white walled wheels on there and then the uh, Team Hot Wheels edition. Uh, we got another Moon Eyes cool combi right there. And up top we've got Teed Off 2. I think we saw that one in our previous case. The Batman Forever Batmobile and the Corvette C7 Z06 convertible. We saw this one in our previous case. This is a, I don't think it's a new casting. Correct me if I'm wrong, it might be but uh, we've got that new Batmobile that looks pretty neat. And we'll go right here. There's another one of those Batmobiles, the El Camino again, and the Corvette Grand Sport Roadster. Those are both from the previous case. We've got the Twin Duction in a brand new color. That is neat. I do like that color. We're seeing a lot of this, like that lighter blue kind of color recently. Uh, we've got the 84 Mustang SVO and another Tesla Model Y, both from the previous case, but excellent, excellent castings. Absolutely love those ones. So happy to get some more of those ones. We've got the custom 2011 Camaro Barbie Extra <laughs> recolor in white with the star right there. My daughters are going to love that one. We're giving that one to them for sure. And we've got the 1988 Jeep Wagoneer. Wow. I think that's a new casting as well. That is very neat. And that one's from the 80s. This might be just a recolor. It might've been a premium before. I'm not 100% sure, but that looks cool. I can't wait to open that one up. Put that aside. What else do we have? We've got the uh, Mazda Savannah RX-7 again, another C7 Z06 convertible, and another Batman Forever Batmobile. We're getting to the bottom right here. We've got the uh, Mazda 787B. That is so cool, I like that. There's the 68 Copo Camaro. This, I believe, is just the standard variation, not the Super Treasure Hunt edition. So there would be a Super Treasure Hunt edition of that one if we had it in the case. Uh, another one of the Bone Shakers, which we saw already. And our last three cars of the case, what are they? We've got the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL again, just the mainline variation, the 84 Mustang SVO, and the Quick Bite. Comment down below your favorite car from this case. We'll be opening them up in a future video. 2023 Hot Wheels D case. I get all of my cases from Grana Toys. If you want to get your own Hot Wheels case sent to you every time a new one comes out, go check out granatoys.com. Link is in the description box below. The regular treasure hunt for this case is Mad Props, and the Super Super treasure hunt for this case is the Lotus Avaya. Hopefully we find one of those in this case. All right, let's go ahead and unbox it. And we'll start right off the top right here. We'll pull out our first three cars. And first up, we have the Mercedes-Benz Unimog 1300, Chrysler Pacifica, and a brand new casting. It's the BMW 507. I've been looking forward to getting this casting. I cannot wait to open this one up. It's a nice classic looking BMW. We'll put those aside and we'll go up right here. We've got the Mazda Savannah RX-7 FC uh, 3S, I believe it is. There we go, nice. That's a cool color, I really like that. We've got head gasket and the Honda Super Cab, and I think that's a new color of the Honda Super Cab as well. So we'll put those aside. We've got clip rod. We've got another BMW 507, that's very cool. We got two of them in the case. And the, the Matt and Debbie Hayes 1988 Pro Street Thunderbird. And that is, I think that's the second color of this one. We had the pink one as the first one. We did get that one in the last case though. All right, we'll put those down. We'll see what we have up here. The Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect. 
pretty neat art cars. Uh, Nissan Leaf Nismo RCO2. And we've got that Pagani Zonda R. We did see this one in the last kiss, but I absolutely love that Zonda R. It looks so good. And that Nissan actually looks pretty cool. I like that Nissan riding on the side of it as well. So pretty neat cars right there. We've got uh, two of the Group C Fantasy cars. That's like a, the hot, new Hot Wheels Fantasy supercar. I actually really like it. I think it looks good. And there's that Remac Nevera. Both of these ones we did see in the previous case as well, but still excellent to get extras of those. What do we have right here? We've got the Erkenstein Rod, and that's a new nice matte finish color on that. Check that one out. We've got the Hot Wheels 55th anniversary logoing on the side of that one too. We've got the 09 Ford Focus. That one, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm not a big fan of that. That's kind of ugly. That is kind of ugly. It's an art cars formation, not my thing. Uh, Dior 3 right there as well. That's a cool color on that one, I like that. And what do we have right here? We've got the Lolux, Lolux, uh, 84 Corvette. It's been a while since we've seen the C4 Corvette come to the Hot Wheels lineup. Even in one of the newer Corvette sets, they skipped the C4 for some reason, but it's neat that we see that one in a nice gold trim right there. We've got the 1990 Honda Civic EF, and that's a new red recolor of that one with Civic written on the side of it. So there we go. I'm not a big Honda Civic fan, but that's a new color if you like that one. We've got the Dior 3 again. It looks like a new color of the McLaren Elva. Wow, that is a crazy burnt orange color. Check that out, that is very interesting. I kind of like that, I do kind of like that. Ford Mustang Mach-E also in a new color as well. So there we go, lots of blue, a little bit of purplish in there, a little bit of silver, lots of colors mixed in, but that looks pretty cool. And this is the RTR variation. You can see the RTR written on the side of it. So that's pretty neat. We've got another one of the Civics right there. We've got the 76 Corvette Greenwood right there, and that's the nice uh, Art Cars logoing. Max Steel right here as well in that white color from the HW Roadsters. And what do we have? We've got another head gasket, another one of the Matt and Debbie Hayes 88 Pro Street Thunderbird, and we've got Snoopy. Look at that, there is Snoopy right there. Snoopy sitting on the top of that. We've got, look at the little peanuts right there. That's pretty neat. That's kind of a fun casting to have. And what do we have? Oh, this is that Hot Wheels Braille Twin Mill. This is really, really cool. So this is in collaboration with the National Federation of the Blind. So you can see that there is Braille written on the outside of the packaging as well as on the car itself. So we'll talk more about this once we open it up, but very, very interesting casting. I really like how they partnered with the Blind Association and come up with some Hot Wheels uh, for the blind and they can feel it. So that's a really cool collaboration to have. So very nice, we'll put that aside for now. We've got the Count Muscula and the Armadillo right there. I don't really like the Armadillo. I know it's from Buzz Lightyear, but it's kind of ugly, kind of a not my thing type of casting. Uh, we got another one of the uh, HW Braille Twin Mills right there. So we've got two of those ones. That's neat. And we've got the Time A Taxi and another one of the Max Steels. All right, we're going down to the second half of the case right here. We'll take that middle cardboard out. And we'll go right to the top right here. Pull out these cars. We've got the Hot Wheels Barbie Extra right there. And you can see all the the Barbie writing and logoing and stuff. And this one, I think I'm giving to one of my daughters. They love the Barbie Hot Wheels cars. Batman Forever, that's a new casting for 2023, the Batmobile. And then also we've got the 88 Jeep Wagoneer. Check that one out. Nice new color variation of that one. I believe that's a new color variation. I don't think that's a new casting. We've seen that one before. Put those aside. And what do we have up here? Oh, wow, check out this. Nissan Skyline GTR R32 from the HWJ Imports. I love I love all the Skylines, the Nissan GTRs. They're very, very neat. So that's a nice new color variation of that. Uh, another one of the Mazda Savannas. And we've got the custom Ford Maverick as well. And I think we saw this one in the last case, if I'm not mistaken as well. So we'll put that one aside. We'll go right up here. We've got the Bone Shaker. I love this color variation, the Bone Shaker. Very, very cool looking. We've got the Jeepster Commando in a new color variation. And we've got the Lucid Air in a new color variation as well. Cool casting. Uh, don't like that color though. No, it's kind of like a like a sand color, metallic sand color. Not really my thing. You might like it, but not my style. 
we'll put that up there. Uh, we've got the 68 Copo Camaro right there. Uh, this is the main line. It would be a super treasure hunt if it was from the previous case, but that is just the, the main line variation of it. And speaking of mainline variations, we've got the mainline variation of the Lotus Avaya. So they do have a super treasure hunt variation of this. We might still get it in this case. So stay tuned and uh, you're gonna see one, trust me. Uh, Mazda 787B right here. There we go, that's a nice one. And what else do we have up here? We've got another one of the bone shakers. We've got the tuned 83 Chevy Silverado. Looks like a new color variation of that. And the Hot Wheels High. We've seen that one recently in quite a few different colors as well. What else do we have? We've got the Dodge Charger Drift car. I like this green. It's a very, very cool looking green color. Uh, another one of the uh, 68 Copa Camaros and another one of the Batman Forever Batmobiles. Very nice. Some good cars in this case. Uh, 82 Cadillac Seville, check that out. Now, I'm not 100% sure if it's a new casting or not, but it's one that we haven't seen for a long time. If it hasn't, I believe it is a new casting though. I think that's one of the new ones for 2023. Uh, pretty cool, like look at that back right there. Just a very interesting design. It's these 80s Cadillacs, which had a lot of weird shapes to them and stuff, but pretty neat, I like that. That's a cool casting, can't wait to open that one up. We've got the Twin Duction. Looks to be a new color of that one and another one of the 1988 Jeep Wagoneers. What else do we have? Another Batman Forever, uh, another Erkenstein Rod, and another Barbie Extra. There we go. I'm okay with doubles. There's some good cars in this case, so having some doubles is fine. Uh, we've got the 76 Greenwood Corvette, and there we've got the 1986 Toyota Van. Look at that. That looks to be a new color one as well. And we've got the treasure hunt for the case. Here we go. Yes, we've got the Mad Props treasure hunt. Very clearly a treasure hunt. You can see on the wings, the, the two logos right there. And if we look underneath the card, you can also see the treasure hunt logo just within the card right there. So nice that we got that one. That's the first time we've seen, uh, I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong. Have we seen an airplane as a treasure hunt before? Possibly we have, but uh, I don't think we've seen mad props as a treasure hunt or a super treasure hunt before. So nice that we got that one. What do we have down here? We've got another one of the Mazda 787Bs, uh, the Pagani Zonda R again, and the Twin Duction again. I mean, again, some good doubles to have. Just check those two out. Very, very cool looking castings. Really like them. And down below, we've got the Dodge Charger Drift car again, another Remac Nevera, and we've got the Bricken Delivery. We did see this one in the previous case, but I think it's a super, super cool casting for 2023. It's a brand new casting for the model year. And our last three cars in the case, and then I'll show you something special here in a second. We've got the Roller Toaster with the Peanut Butter Edition. We've got the Custom Ford Maverick again, and the Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect. Now we we did not get the super treasure hunt for the case. This would be it, but I do have a special thing to show you. We do have one right here. I actually did purchase one separately uh, just because I really, really liked it. And so I did pick it up. Unfortunately, I did pay quite a bit more than I should have for it, but it's one that I wanted to add to my collection. So if we get a closer look, you can see the, the paint. It's a little bit different. So that's a little bit darker. This is maybe slightly lighter and then it's got that more premium paint on there. And then the wheels you can see are different on them as well. And then we've got the real rider wheel and tires on the Super Treasure Hunt. So uh, this is a US carded Super Treasure Hunt. You can see, we can see the guaranteed for life symbol right there. Um, and then we've got my international card of the Lotus Avaya, the regular mainline. So very cool that I do have it. Unfortunately, I didn't get one in the case, but we did get a Treasure Hunt for the case. So very good case so far, guys. Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.